After the end of World War II, the fast food chain was split to two, McDonald's and Burger King. This marked the beginning of the era called the Fry War. All right, you are clear to jump, and don't lose your backpack on a tree. Hey, get away from there. Stop it. I warned you. Say goodbye. Damn. Uh-oh. Parachutes. Do you still have your backpack? Wait, let me check. Oh shit. Don't worry. From here, you will continue your mission without any weapons and equipment. Your code name is Naked Snake. I'll be referring to you as Snake from now on. Your mission is to rescue the scientist Sokolov because he is the best fries maker in the world. If you have any more questions, then ask me or paramedic or the boss. Hello, Snake. I'm your doctor. If you are wounded or need any... Yes, whatever. Snake, listen. The boss is here, too. Yes, I'll explain it some other time. Now hurry up with your mission. I still want to watch my favorite TV show and drink some tea. Hey, stop. Are you an intruder? No, just a tourist. Oh, uh, okay. Hey, wait a second. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker! Oh, aliens, don't kill me! Calm down. I'm here to bring you to America. If so, let's hurry up. American Idol is on soon, and I want to watch it. Oh, Ryan Seacrest, I love you. Don't move. Oh, crap. So, we finally meet. I am the cool and fantastic... Beretta Ocelot. Meow. You're pretty good, but you should use a revolver. It fits you more, and besides that, Beretta Ocelot sounds like a little bitch. You're the bitch! Ugh. Boss, what are you doing here? Nothing special, just portraying my country. <laughs> ah, don't kill me, I'm a virgin! Ah! Oh, uh, boss, uh, help! Drift away. Paramedic. Oh my god, Snake. You got totally beaten. By a woman. How embarrassing. Shut up! Get me out of here! <laughs> Excellent. Now that's what I call a gun. Colonel, what do you think you're doing? That's one of our own restaurants! I don't care! I have to blow up something! So, you got beaten up by a woman. Stop bothering me with that. Do you have any news? Indeed. Yesterday, the President of McDonald's got an unexpected call from the Burger King. President Grimace. Yes, I hear you. A few days ago, one of our restaurants was destroyed by a nuclear Big Mac. One of your weapons. Our restaurants had nothing to do with that. One of our soldiers defected to the Soviet Union and took two nuclear Big Macs with her. You may know her as the boss. The man who managed the defection was a Soviet colonel named Volgin. But those weapons were yours. I need to get some kind of proof to ensure that this wasn't caused by McDonald's in order to avoid a nuclear war between our restaurants. I understand. You have to eliminate the boss and Volgin and recover the last nuclear device to prove your innocence. 
I give you one week. If you can't eliminate them until then, we have no choice but to launch all our whoppers to McDonald's. Simply put, in order to avoid a nuclear conflict, we have to prove that McDonald's was not involved in that explosion. We will send you to the Soviet Union for eliminating the boss, Vogan, destroying the Shagohard, whatever that is, and rescuing Sokolov. Let's move. Oh, and can you finish the mission quickly? My favorite TV show will come on tonight. I can't believe I'm flying such a cool thing in the 60s. Um, how do I fly this thing anyway? Oh, my head! Boss? No, not again. Go home. If I see you again, I will kill you.